Hello everyone, this is David from goldstartool.com and today I'm going to show you the difference between the two most common type of snaps in the sewing industry, bag making, leather making and this is the question that I get all day long. There are two snaps that is mostly used in uh, garment making, bag making and they're called, one is called ring snap and one is called string snap so we're gonna go over the difference between ring snap and the string snap we're gonna go over the sizes and we're gonna go are you ready we're gonna go over the difference between single cap and double cap ring or a spring snap it's it it looks uh very hard but it's very easy so i'm gonna go ahead and show you uh that's why we have all these uh, containers already because we also at goldstartool.com we have this thing ready at the counter so when the customers come in we need to try we got to make sure we have everything ready for them to use our dies and our presses and sometimes even us make a uh, uh, we, we, we make a mistake and we don't know which is which but that's why we have everything in container right here so there is a very popular item that is uh, used in leather industry and the most common one is called uh, ring snap ring snap has four parts like any other uh, closure or snaps and uh, this is the way it is you have the cab And I'm sure you see the cab. And the cab goes with ring snap. Now, I'm going to do a close-up right here if I can, if you could see inside the cab, inside the socket. There is a spring right here. There is a ring, I'm sorry, right here. And uh, that's why it's called ring snap. So the cap goes with the socket and this is the post and this is the male part of it. If we make sense. Cab. And then you have the ring part. And again, if you look closely, you see there is a ring right there. And then you have the other part, and these two go together. This is called ring snap. Now, in spring snap, you have a snap that there is a writing, and if you look closely, there is a spring right in here. You could see from the back, it much easier that there is a spring right there. You see that spring, but this is the face. So, to make it easy for you guys, this is the difference. This is spring snap with English writing on it. And this is ring snap, and there is a ring inside. Now, which one is more sturdy, which one is more stronger? the ring snap spring snap looks better nicer i'm not gonna uh, concentrate on the other three parts of the snap because uh, those are all the same uh, but what i will do is i'm going to show you only the male part of it so it's a one-man show today i'm sorry if i'm so with the spring snap, you have these parts, these two parts going together. Usually, uh, it's used for a ladies' garment, also men garment, jackets. But if you have leather and stuff, hides and stuff, these two are very common. They go together. But these two could also be for lighter 
leather or soft leather. Uh, so these two go together, and they call, so one to my left is ring snap, this is a spring snap. And this is the cap, and this is one of the posts for this part. These four parts go together. And for the spring snap, you have a different type of post. Let me get them, and I'm gonna show you. So for spring snap, you have these two parts that go together, and of course they had bagged everything out here. I'm gonna take them out, so. So we have them all, when you receive this stuff, we have them all packed. Like we have the post in one bag, the cap in the other bag, we have the ring in the other, we have them all ready. So you don't have to separate anything. We sometimes even put the uh, dies in there too. So when you order the dies, we order them together. So this is the cap and the cap goes with the spring snap, and this is the stud, goes with the nipple right here. So they call this spring snap. And this is the back. One has a cap, and one has the stud looking in the back. Like this one. See that one? Now, they come in three sizes. Uh, they come in size, ring snap comes in size 24 line, which is 15 millimeter and 5 eighth. That's how you measure it. You measure the cap. A lot of people call in and say, what do you measure? You measure the cap. This one is 5 eighth. In Chinese, 24 millimeter, 15 millimeter and it's five eighths, we have them right here. So if you could see right here, we have 803J is the item number 24 line, 15 millimeter five eighth ring snap. And we could, we also have them in the smaller size of half an inch. So ring snap comes only five eighth and half an inch, and we only size the, the cap. In spring snap, they come in three sizes, 5 eighth, half an inch, and 3 eighth. So that would be 24 line, 15 line, not 24 line, 15 line, 24 line, 15 millimeter, and there is also 20 line, which is half an inch, and we also have 3.8, which is 16 line. So it's confusing, but if you wanna go with English, number sizing, 5.8, half for ring snap, 5.8, half, 3.8 for spring snap. So that's the most important part. Now if you know the difference between the spring snap and the difference between ring snap and spring snap, I'm gonna show you now the double cap, what it means to be double cap. Double cap means that you could use the snaps in a reversible garment. In this case, both have caps in the back. Meaning instead of having a stud, both backs are caps. So if you want to do reverse, you could use the same die. You don't, you don't use the same snaps. They come in different sizes. We also have them in five eighth and half. There is no three eighth because they're not very common at all. But what it is that, that there is two cap. Instead of having one cap in each package, you receive two cap. One is smaller, one is larger, but this is how the double cap works. Instead of having the post or the stud, 
you get two caps. So reversible garment, garment that you could see the back, a lot of people would like to use the uh, double cap snap. Also very common, and uh, you get all of the snaps that we sell, all the sizes, that's something else that you should know. All the garment snaps that we sell, they have their own dedicated die. If you buy size 16, size 20, size 24 line, which is which translate to 3 8, half or 5 8, every single one of them have its own dedicated die. You cannot ex change the die between the snaps. They all have item numbers and they all have uh, four dies, one for the cab, one for the stud, and one for the post, and one for the rivet. They all have four dies because there are four sizes. Um, I hope I uh, explained this video very well. Uh, obviously, a little bit confusing when it comes to sizing and double caps. Uh, and also, you have on top of that the colors. But when you go to our website, this is the most amazing thing that we have done, that this is the only website that you could see uh, that has that. that. When you go to the snap section, you could choose your size, you could choose your color, you could choose your quantity, and then you could choose, do you need a die only? Do you need a machine with a die? Do you need a hand press or anything else? They're all in one page, uh, very easy to understand. Uh, again, this was one of the questions that was brought to me to make a video, and uh, that's what I do. I'll wait for your question, and there are more and more video coming up, but thank you for watching. Please like our video channel, video YouTube. Like our video, write a comment, and give us a thumbs up, and let us know what you want us to do a video next. Thank you, and thank you, and thank you. Bye-bye. website goldstartool.com